Most people believe that success leads to happiness. So many people look at people who are more successful than them with jealousy, and it creates immense suffering in their lives. But the fact of the matter is, financial success is not related to happiness. Jim Carrey famously talks about how he was never happy, and he thought if he just had some success, he could finally be happy. And then he became more successful than he ever dreamed in his entire life. He had more fame than he ever dreamed, and yet he was still unhappy. He was still in the exact same mental place he was before he had success. We often think that we should put off our happiness now until we've achieved success, and then we can be happy finally. But the truth of the matter is, we have to learn to be happy now while even achieving and striving for success. Because there is only now. And what we do with this moment and how we treat ourselves in this moment determines how we'll feel in future moments. The goal of life is happiness. The needs of life are those material and financial achievements. And misery occurs when we confuse the two. Science has shown that once people have their basic needs met, more money does not lead to more happiness. Happiness does occur when we can finally put food on the table, when we can finally have enough for a roof over our head, for transportation, health care, and all our basic needs. But beyond that, more money has no impact on our happiness. And while it's wonderful to strive for achievements, the question becomes, can we enjoy the journey? Can we create some space, peace, and stillness in the striving? Can we see the ups and downs of our journey with a broader perspective so that we don't lose ourselves along the way, so that we don't stress over every temporary setback, and so we don't become cocky and arrogant in our up moments? Can we maintain equanimity, calm, and clarity? No matter what is happening around us, and the answer is yes. We all have the ability within us to center ourselves. Every second we are breathing, we have the ability to breathe out any tension and stress we're holding on to and breathe in, filling our deep lungs with healing oxygen and allowing our mind and body to tap in to that infinite reservoir of joy that each one of us has within us, no matter our circumstance, no matter our bank accounts. And when we have that 
strength within us. There's no jealousy of the numbers someone else has in their bank accounts because we are in a state of bliss, mesmerized by the beauty and variety of forms in our lives, good and bad. We can simply be with it in peace, allowing nothing to disturb our inner peace and allowing our stress to lower, our health to be greater, and we are left only feeling happiness for ourselves, happiness for the success of others, and we can even enter a state where work doesn't even feel like work. And this helps us work smarter, work better, be more creative, and ultimately, be more successful.